two countries, same AI risks, opposite reactions. We're talking about South Korea and the United States. South Korea recently forced Alipay to delete an AI model that was trained on illegal data. It eliminated an entire system. You may also remember that South Korea banned DeepSeek after this privacy regulator found that data held by DeepSeek was stored on servers in China. South Korea's regulator is requiring explicit user consent, detailed records, and the ability to completely delete data if required by the regulator. In contrast, America is doing something else entirely. We have a new cybersecurity executive order this week, which you might be forgiven for missing given everything else in the news. It rolls back Biden-era secure software requirements. It also removes digital ID initiatives and post-quantum encryption mandates. And finally, it ends AI-powered cyber defense programs. It remains to be seen what the implications are, but as you can see, there's a huge philosophical divergence here, not just a policy difference between the two approaches. And while governments are debating the best approach to AI governance, budget cuts are everywhere. Up next.